Hey guys, we are going to do a, sorry my hair's, <laughs> we're going to do a get ready with me. I know, long time, long, 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 too long, too long lady, too long, I know, I know, I'm sorry, but we're going to do it this morning. So here we go, we're going to use this palette, hold it where y'all can see it maybe, here we go, we're going to use this palette. Beautiful colors. So I hope you're going to enjoy this. Um, it's been a long time since I've done one, and we're just going to get it done. We're going to get her done. And so if you want to see how I achieve this look, which I know it's not the greatest look in the world, okay? But just bear with me, okay? I only have so much of a canvas here to work with, so <laughs> let's, let, let's just get right into it, shall we? Right now. Okay, guys, we're going to get started on the makeup. Um, I'm in my closet room. This is a bedroom, but it is a closet. I've made it into my closet. So if you see things hanging on the wall for all you newbies um, on the wall, that is my necklaces and my purses are like up above. So it, and it's a mess. My closet's a mess. I'm in the midst of cleaning, but, you know, things happen. So there you go. Now. This lighting is not good, so I am going to try to do a get ready with me. I've already applied my, I just got out of the shower too. I've already applied my CoverGirl Clean. I love this first. I used to do a primer. I had been doing a primer. Every time I do a primer, let me just tell you, um, it makes my face woolly. By the end of the day, my face looks like an oil pit, and I do not like that. And I don't normally have an oily face. So, having said that, I don't even know what I'm going to wear on my eyes today. I'm thinking about just going with my usual orange. I'm wearing black and brown today. so, And I'm using the CoverGirl. Hang on at me. I'll show you. Let me get this done and then I'll show you when I put it away. I am in kind of a little rush, so it's rainy today, cloudy, so there you go. CoverGirl Vitalist Healthy Powder. Love this stuff. Okay, then let's see. We're going to go do this one. Uh, this is the e.l.f. Hydrating Camo Concealer Satin Finish, and this is in P. Uh, light peach I go through these like crazy I really do yeah probably think she puts her makeup on weird okay okie dokie let's get this done I haven't even dried my hair yet. I just been bitty. Just so bitty. I have water to soak my sponge. I didn't soak this end of it. I soaked the other end of it a while ago. I always keep water in here. I keep it. I ran out of the rose water spray face spray. So I just put water in there so when I need it, I can just like grab it, you know. Grab it and go. Well, that's picking it up, isn't it? <laughs> picking that better than my mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the oldest of them all? Me! Just kidding. Not really, but. <laughs> okay. I think... I don't really know. I want to go orange. I think I'm going to do the Oakalon palette. Take me home to. And y'all can tell I use that orange a lot, can't you? Because I'm hitting pan. <laughs> I love it. I think on the, this part, I'm going to do the yellow, though. This one. But first, let's use the Wet n Wild paint pot. I love this Wet n Wild paint pot. 
Guys, I may have to stop this and go dry my hair real quick because I don't want it to dry completely like this, you know. I do this a lot. I will let my hair start drying and then I will run in there, dry it, and then come back to my makeup. But then you guys won't know that because I pause it, edit, and go back and then y'all's like, oh, she just went right through that, just sailed right through that. It's all in the editing. You know what I mean? Okay, got this done. No way y'all's gonna notice this. All of a sudden, you're gonna see my hair dry, and you're gonna be like, oh, look at that. Her hair just dries and styles on its own. <laughs> Could be a get ready with me, I guess. And... Sorry, I have a message. Okay, put that on. Oin, oin. Okay, hair's dried, tied back, but dried. You know, one thing I like about my haircut is this right here. I can put it this way, or I can put it this way. Either or, because the sides are the same. See? And sometimes it just don't work. Hear my coffee gurgling? I got coffee making. Huh. Sometimes it just don't work on this side, so... That's neither here nor there. Let's get started, shall we? All right, I'm going to use this color right there. It's a yellow. And we're going to put it right here on the lid. To tell you the truth, I may just go all over with this one particular color. Three colors. I'm going to use the white that I just put on my eyes. This and the orange. That's what we're going to do today. Guys, I'm sorry, my messages keep going off turn my phone on it goes a nuts it just goes a nuts okay i've said this before if you guys have not picked one of these up at the dollar tree it's it's a it's a game changer all you got to do and as as long as it's not liquid um found a uh, eyeshadow on there as long as it's powder you just rub it around to get the other you know whatever you've used the color to get the color off so you can move on to the next and it does work. Let me show you. You see all that? Can't do that in my trash can. It works. All that came from my brushes. It is awesome. That's what it looks like right there. It's just a little little sponge. Yep. I love it. Because you know sometimes when you're in a hurry you don't always get the color off your brush before you put it back in the thingy majiggy you know and then like if you're going for a light color and it has a little brown on it and you're like it's not what I wanted what just happened here okay that was a little dramatic but you know you know you know you know you know you know Jesus is alive alive forevermore if any of you are Pentecost you know this song Alive, alive, alive forevermore. Jesus is alive, alive forevermore. Okay, I've had no coffee. Just got up just just, just a little bit ago. To got up, took a shower. Y'all ever do that thinking, well, if I take a shower, I will be able to wake up. Oh, today's my day off, in case y'all was wondering. Today is my day off. Um, I have to take my mother to the eye doctor. She's having trouble seeing. And I really think it's her. Uh, um, the cataracts, they say sometimes they will, little beads or something will come over your eyes. What is that? Not now. Okay. Um, little beads will come over your eyes and they when you have, it's done it before, after she had cataract surgery, and, um, that look right? Yeah, that's all right. And all he did was put liquid or something on there, and then go over it with a little, I don't know, little gun or something, and it come off, and she could see better. And I'm hoping this is what it is, because he did say her eyes were deteriorating. So, I just pray that's what it is, and her eyes aren't getting worse. I pray it's just a little beads over her eyes 
Okay, guys, that's it for that part of it. And then I'm just going to use, I think I'm going to use this brush. I'm not going through my brushes. This one I got at the Dollar Tree. Love it. This one is from my, my expensive set. The um, It's eyeshadow blender. It's the, oh, what do they call these? I can't really pronounce it right. Shakira, Sakira, Sakura, something like that. I've had these brushes for years and years, and they're still just like new. All right, we're going to use this orange one right here. Right there. Alive, alive, alive forevermore. My Jesus is alive, alive forevermore. Alive, alive, alive forevermore. Jesus is alive. Sing hallelujah, sing hallelujah. Praise break. Early in the morning, we got to have a praise break just to say good morning, Lord. Do y'all ever do that? Just when you get up in the morning, say good morning, Lord. Thank you for your many blessings on me. You know what I think I'm going to do? There is a weird color in here. Let's see what colors they are. Ooh, that's what colors they are. <laughs> right in here. I'm going to try to use that. And see what I get right here in the corner. What y'all think? I always like adding a little surprise lately. It's like a little something, something. I added one day, I was getting a little crazy, and I added green, lime green, with orange, the lime green. Boy, that editing thing sure is wonderful, isn't it? Okay. I'm getting hot. Air conditioner. Went off while I was in the shower, and I was like, oh, thank goodness, because I'm about to freeze. And now it's like, oh, I'm hot. We can just never be satisfied. Conway. 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 Okay, I kind of don't, I kind of like this a little lighter, so I'm going to take the brush that I use for the white and just kind of go over that. Just not really happy with that part of it. Not at all. Okay. Now then, that's it for that. Now, Physician's Formula. This is my favorite eyeliner. I just love it. Here's what the end looks like. Love it. It just glides on. That's why I like it. It just smooth as a baby's bullet. Sorry, guys. I have to concentrate. Okay? I, 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 I can't talk to you right now. Y'all just going to have to wait. Sometimes I get so out of line that I have to go back on the other one and make it just as thick as I did this one. Because I refuse to fix it. If I fix it, then I have to redo my eyes. Y'all know that part of it, right? Y'all know? See, then I just go back and make this one look like that one. <laughs> and then, I think I'm, I'm going to have to purchase me another one. And right there. And right there. Make my wing. My wing-a-danger. Okay, here we go. A little bit thick in there. I don't like it that thick. I really don't, but. But it's just going to have to be because I am not fixing it. This is one of those days where it's like, okay, it's just going to have to be what it is, what it is. And that's just going to have to be. 
guys, a lot of people, and it looks so good on them, they will not do eyeliner on their bottom, on their bottom, uh, the bottom eyelash, eyeliner on the bottom eye, whatever. <laughs> but I have to, because if I don't, I look like I'm undone. You know what I mean? Just undone. Undone. Do you know what undone means? Plain and simple and not put together. All right, Marsha, quit messing with it before you make it worse. <laughs> I'll have my eyelashes on, so. Matter of fact. Ta-da! Guess what? Every time I go into the Dollar, Gen Dollar General now, the one Dollar General, the new one, I always look to see if they have my eyelashes. And if they do, I grabbed two or three. <laughs> No, I had two last time, and I grabbed two. Of course, you know, I go through these like crazy because I even wear these for work, so, you know. Okay, now what I do is I use the Duo glue, and I drop it in on my tray. I bought these to, like, you know, you put your glue in, you know, your eye glue, little trays. Forget that noise. I just put it in my little tray, you know, my mirror tray. Yes. So I'm gonna I'm gonna let that set. I put it in here and let it start setting up instead of putting you know putting it on your eyelash and waiting a hundred years. I don't like that. So I what I do is just go ahead and put it there. Let it aren't those beautiful? I just love these eyelashes. These eyelashes are just a bomb.com. This is called Nuance D L S H O six Nuance, and I don't know. I'm using this my other camera or phone, so I don't know if this is gonna show backwards or not, but. If it does, I'm sorry. So anyway, there's that. But you can't find them. Or, well, I couldn't. I looked everywhere online trying to find these thinking things, and I couldn't find them. The only place I could find them was the Dollar General. So, Dollar General it is. Okay, come on now. Don't make me have to pull on you hard and then break you. Okay. <laughs> There's a one. See, that one goes on this side. So let's put that one on this side, the left side. And let's get this one. My coffee's ready. And let's get this one. And put it on the, this side. I usually go ahead and match them up to make sure they're long enough or not too long. I usually never have to cut these. But, of course, I have big eyes. Look at those big, fat eyes of mine. You see them big fat eyes of mine? Yeah. Oops. All right. I always throw the box away because when I get done with them, I have a little, a little pretty sunflower that's down in my drawer, and I put my lashes back in there. So when I'm ready, I just go right back and get to him, you know? All right, what was I going to do before I start acting like a fool? Oh. I'm going to curl my lashes. I'm going to curl my lashes. Take a breath and breathe. Again, for you guys who are looking and thinking she hangs her necklaces on her wall, how yucky. I mean, you know, this is not my bedroom. This is, again, this is my closet. We have a three-bedroom home. I have a back bedroom that is set up for guests or for my son who comes in from uh, out of town. And um, this room is made into my closet. Because I have so much stuff. My husband says, if you get rid of some of those purses, some of those shoes. But, no. So, anyway, so I made a bedroom into a closet. And it suits me just fine. Uh, just fine. And that's why you see stuff hanging on the walls. Because it's, it's, it's a closet. I'm using the Rimmel Lash Accelerator. Love this stuff. Make sure it makes your eyelashes grow. Sorry, guys, I got to pick this up and do it because I can't do it with, you know. Hurts my back to bend down so much. The other morning I was getting ready and I noticed myself doing this the whole time I was putting my makeup on. And my back started hurting and I was like, well, foo, bring it up to you. Don't sit there and go down. Girl, 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 girl. What is your problem? Your brain don't work sometimes. Ah. Yeah, a little big old long black hair that's attached to my head. Jess, Jess, it surely is. 
That's when I get stuff on my uh, above, I let it dry, and then I take a Q-tip and get it off. That's what I do. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And then I'm going to do a little bit down here. Not that I want these to grow out real long, but, you know. I always do a little bit of the lash accelerator, and then I go back and do uh, a different mascara. And if I don't do this now, while I see it and thinking about it, I'll go off and forget it like I did the last time. The last time I forgot to do my eyebrows. <laughs> uh, it's like, mm, mm, I look silly. And I'm just going over it like this, like so. I just kind of draw around it. You guys may notice I am not real particular about my eyebrows. They don't have to be like perfect i don't spend like a hundred years on them i just i just draw on them and then take my little spoolie thingy here you know my little sakura spoolie and then i just do this and then i'm done with them again they don't have to be perfect now my mother is going tomorrow to get her hair done and i may just get my eyebrows waxed i do love my eyebrows waxed oh how i love my eyebrows waxed it just feels you know you just feel so clean and 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 all that stuff yeah 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 all right there's that all right i got that setting up so let's go ahead and just do that part of it okay first off let me get that off of there where i got uh mascara May have to go back with that a little bit with this. Let's show you. Let's use this one. You know, if you don't hold your mouth just right, it won't go on right. You know what I mean? It's it's how you hold your mouth. You know. Okay. There's that. Now let's do the eye blushes and then we'll move on to the rest of the face. All right. I always use a Q-tip. Q-tip. And then let's just go ahead and put the left one on. I just kind of bend them a little bit. And then I go for the glue, put it on the end. And then I just, whoops. Can't really see what I'm doing today. I'm telling you what. Boy, I tell you what, I woke up yesterday with a migraine. I was off yesterday, too, and I mean off, off. I didn't have to go nowhere, take nobody anywhere. I was just off. And I woke up with a migraine. My head was pounding. And I, like, never got it to quit pounding. Okay, I hope you guys can see what I'm doing, what I'm doing. Can y'all see me from here? I just laid them right there about where I want them. Mourn them. Then I take my tweezers and I take this in and I lay it where I want it. Right where I want it and then I push. Push, push, push. And there you have it. Then we're going to do the other one. The other butter peanut butter cup. Y'all remember that commercial? And I just put it right along there, like a diet. So, like Chester on gun smoke, like a diet. Okay, and then we're gonna lay it right where I want it. I always try to match up the back, the the back end first, this end first. And because I can always pull it with the front part if it's not where I want it. I usually don't have a problem though, but some days, there are some days. You know, sometimes people say, oh, y'all, you make that look so easy. Well, trust me, every day is not the same. There will always be days that you're like, Ugh, you know what I mean? Now, sometimes... 
well most of the time I'll let that dry a minute and then I'm gonna go back over it with my eyeliner pen because to me the eyeliner pen just seals it just in case the glue you know you missed it or the glue didn't stick or it you know what I mean this just kind of seals it up this just kind of seals the deal you know so I just go over where the I go over it where the um where the glue is this glue it's gray but it dries clear that's not why I go over it. I go over it to kind of seal it. It's just, that's my secret way of keeping it on there. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, Brian? All right, now we're going to move on to the rest of the face, and we're going to be done. Done. So far, so good. I'm sorry about the lighting, guys. It's The window is behind you, just right behind your back there. And um, it's, it's, rain. it's, yeah, forecast, it's rainy, it's, it's all that good stuff. All right, let's get the brushes out that we're going to use. I always have some of my bronzer left over, and, and I always go down the sides of my nose with it. All right, we are going to use the Milani Intense Bronze Glow. Can y'all see that? There we go. Love it. So pretty. The packaging is just gorgeous. Put it right along in there. And then I always like to go underneath here. You know where the fat part is right there? I always like to go on the sides here and then right underneath there. Because it kind of camouflages. I don't know. To me, it camouflages the fat, you know? You know, all that fat, all that quiet stuff. Okay, and then we are going to go with a Milani again. That was the Milani bronzer. We're going to go with the Milani. Um, this is the Coralina 08. I know this by heart because I only use this. Now, if I need some pink, I will. I've got some pink in here, but I don't use pink that often because y'all know I do orange all the time. And then I just kind of, it's got that little glitter in it. I love the glitter. You don't really see it, the glitter, but I like it anyway. You would think it would show up, but it really don't unless it shows up in the camera and makes a liar out of me. A little bit on my nose. Make it look like I got sunburned. Make it look like I've been in the sun. I've been in the sun. Oh, I've been in the sun. Sorry. Oh, here comes the air conditioner. Here comes the sun. Here comes the sun. Don't worry. I'm not going to look this bad in a minute. I will fix it. I will fix it. Hang on. Then we are going to Yo's. The, where's it at? Again, go get you some. Get you one of these. These are just the bomb.com for your brushes. Okay, we're going to use the e.l.f. This is an e.l.f. highlighter, and I've hit pan on the two middle ones. So now we're moving in on this one and the pink one, but we're going to use the white one to dye. And we're just going to pat that right down there like that. I like a lot of highlighter. I'm sorry, I do. Some people use very little. Not me, man. I like that highlighter. We're going to highlight. Ooh, not like that. <laughs> Hold up. Marsha. Don't like it that much. <laughs> Got a little carried away there, didn't I? Carry me away. Here, and it's not going to look this bad because I don't have my powder on yet. So, y'all just hold up. Just hold up. So far, so good, I think. I don't know. It shows up worse in the camera. Uh, yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to use my Sakura brush again. One of my Sakuras. This one says powder. It has powder on it. <laughs> so, and then I'm going to use CoverGirl Clean because why I am a CoverGirl girl. CoverGirl girl, yes. There is nothing like that clean smell. Oh my goodness, guys. This is just oh. the the cover girl with it says cover girl clean. Has it smells like Noxzema. It has, I don't know if it has it in it or well, it'd have to, I guess, for it to smell like that. But 
It smells so stinking good. It smells clean. Y'all know Noxzema always smells clean anyway. Y'all know what I'm talking about when I say Noxzema? We just want to say that. Um, it comes in a blue tub. My mom used to use it. And I used to use it all the time for like makeup remover, take my makeup off, which I don't have to now because I have those rags. Uh, Wex, oh, what is it called? I don't want to mess it up. Wex, I'll put it right here. I ordered their, their face rags that you remove your makeup. And let me tell you, you don't even have to use soap. I mean, you know, less soap you use on your face, the better off you are anyway. But, um, Norwex, Norwex, it is the bomb.com. Let me tell you, I ordered their rags. I'm going to go back and order some more. They have a body rag too that you, for scrubbing, <laughs> I'm going to get it. That stuff is the bomb. I really like it. I thought about selling it because it's so good. I mean, I'm telling you, it's good stuff. I can't really explain it because I don't really know a whole lot about it. It's got that silver stuff in it where you don't even have to use soap. It just, it, at first I was like, that don't really work. And I watched Amy Mesh, the Away Girl, uh, take her makeup off with it. No soap, no nothing, just wet it. And I was like, no way, girl, honey hush, really? Really, 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 yeah. How about a little bit of a... Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. This is Rimmel lip liner. And I can never remember the name of it. Curlberry, Coralberry 59. She always tells me what color it is because I can't never remember. Thank you, Coralberry 59, for keeping me straight. Lauren is her name. Beautiful name, isn't it? How about that? It's Warren. Okay, guys, what y'all think? Let's see. Now, oh, I haven't done the bottom. Oh, I didn't do my bottom lashes. Just didn't do them. And what I'm going to do my bottom lashes with is, I think I'm going to use this one, the Lash Sensational. This does make your lashes longer if you want uh, mascara that makes your lashes look longer this does work it do it do work okay here we go now I can see better I love this mascara I really do you know I was buying that uh, Lancome, the, uh, let me show you, Grandiose Extreme Lancome, it's a good mascara, but it's expensive. This stuff is just as good, and I'm not lying, Lash Sensational, it's by Maybelline, and it's the, uh, I have, it's Hydrofuge. I have found the Hydrofuge makes your lashes look longer. I don't know. I know. I know. Yeah, I was going to say, Marsha, you're full of it. Really, if it says Hydrofuge on there, your lashes are going to look a lot longer than if it don't. This is Hydrofuge. I don't know if the Hydrofuge is the one that goes with the um, waterproof. Probably. I don't know. But the Hydrofuge is the way to go. The one that says Hydrofuge. It is the way to go, Joe. Joe. I need a cup of Joe. Cup of Java Joe? What do they call it? Joe. Cup of Joe. Java Joe. I'm talking about coffee now, guys. I, yeah. I'm just rambling. What do you think? See? See how it makes them look? Kind of makes them look a lot like these. But, you know. And then, I do take it, the rest of it and go up on these. And that kind of seals them, seals the deal too. Make them stay, you know, they stick to, makes them stick to your lashes. Some people don't, they do that, but they don't frisk them up. But I like to frisk mine up. Okay, now then. I think, guys, this is it. I think 
this is as far as I'm going. You know? I don't know why I do all this. I'm going to have to wear a mask in the office, in the doctor's office, and you know my makeup's going to be like. If I plaster or powder, make sure it stays, especially right around in there. <laughs> I hate those stag on mask. All right. I haven't done my hair yet, guys, so it's not going to look the best. One thing about this hairdo, though, you don't really have to do it because I like it to stick up and look like it's just everywhere. I told her when she cut it, she said up on top. I said, I want you to cut my hair to look like I just got out of bed and I haven't combed it yet. I want it to stick straight up on my head. And she said, okay. So she did. See how short it is? Yeah. Yeah. And I'm going to wear it on the side today. It looks longer on this side because she cut me kind of short on that side. But again, you see how these are cut identical so I can take my bangs and I can go over here with them. See? And make it look like that or I can go over here with them and it will look better once I get my hair done or you know once I get the straight iron on it but anyway there's that y'all don't care about that part do you do you do you do you no yeah I don't all right there's that okay guys this is it this is the look dish dish whoop where'd you go where'd you go this is the look for uh, uh get ready with me and again I'm using the um, Ocalon Oak, Oakle, palette take me home love it I love this palette this is a great palette so there you have it I hope you guys enjoyed my uh, get ready with me this is for all you who have requested and requested and requested and said hey I like you I like all your videos but I like your get ready with me you guys have been so patient with me on doing these and again I am gonna try to get set up in that back room more to be a little lighter um, in the guest room yeah I know or do something in here different I don't know um, I need to get a ring light don't know that might work so anyway guys that's it this is the look I hope you enjoyed it and um, Hope you guys have a wonderful day, and remember, keep Jesus in it, and it'll always work. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, click the bell, so you'll be notified for all my future notifications, and if you just don't mind terribly, share my channel, share my channel, help me grow, and I would appreciate it greatly. Thank you to all my newbies, and I say newbies, to all the ones who have just subscribed to me, Thank you guys for coming around. Thank you guys for hanging out. Thank you for subscribing. And for all of my, my faithful ones that have been with me for a long time, thank you guys too because you guys are awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Awesome applesauce. Is that what they say? Awesome applesauce. Apple. Uh, maybe I'm just hungry. I need to go get some coffee, okay? All right, guys. I will talk to you all later. 